hello this is b welcome to a new unboxing time today i'm gonna be unboxing something i ordered from travelers notebook so i cannot wait to unpackage this okay so this came in a um, fedex package right here and then um it included this travelers times a copy English version is um, issue number 17 which I previously got in my um, other two orders very nice and here we go okay so by the way I I forgot what I got, but I think now I can see. So I remember now what I ordered. This is their 2024 lineup, and I'm so excited. This is the first time that I get to order um, their, uh, I think it's called Diary uh, lineup. So, oh my goodness, I'm so excited. They're so cute, and I love the colors as well. So let me... Um, Oh yes, I also ordered a sticker release paper um, on this size. I got one previously, but let me place this on the side. Oh, this is so adorable. And I really love the theme for this year, which is Traveler's Town. Everything waiting for you. So nice. I love traveling, so this really works well with me and my goals for 2024. So let me place this here. Oh yeah, I also ordered this little um how you call this um i actually think this one came for free as a gift let me double check but yes so we have here the regular size and the passport size of their diaries for 2024 um so let's just start with this one this is the monthly version and this is the weekly I really want to check them out and try them out uh, just to see how the size and format works with me. I like their um, the Midori paper and um, although I don't use Traveler's Notebook as much as for example my Hobonichi's, um, uh, this is something that uh, I really wanted to try for 2024. Uh, here we also have their uh, folder and i think these are stickers oh no it's a board pencil board oh i love that color here the yellow with the brown and uh, i really like also their theme of traveling this is so cute and i also got their uh, regular weekly uh, versions um, this is the vertical and this is a horizontal and I thought that I also ordered the monthly, but I think I made a mistake and I placed an order for two of these. So I may have to check if they still have available the monthly version. Um, or maybe I ordered these on purpose. I don't know. But anyways, I have two of these. And then um, the vertical version is my favorite uh, layout across the board. Um, so I cannot wait to check this out. And I also have their sticker set. I guess they don't have stickers on this size, or maybe they didn't order. Uh, but yes, I have the sticker set right here. This is so cute. Oh, I love these one, the, the little bears, polar bears. You may know that I love polar bears or any bear related um, illustration or artwork right there and this is their pencil board doesn't match with these okay they are different let's see the back wow they also have different color right there really nice this is so cute is this california i think so and then we have their folder which is also different from the um, passport version right there lovely color combination as well and i like the illustrations here really nice 
Um, so yes, so let me uh, package each of these items so that we can take a closer look. This is actually a gift that uh, Traveler's Notebook sent to all uh, the customers that the place an order 75 in or more. So let's check this out. Wow, it's really nice. And I just read that uh, this is um, olive leather right there. At first I thought it was their brown leather. But then again, I don't have their brown leather, so um, is there uh, olive leather right there with this lovely gold embossing? Very nice. And this is a, a leather tag. And uh, I have to find out how to use this. But yes, really, really nice gift. How cute is this? Um, their passport size, it's uh, such a cute size. It's really tiny as you can see here. And for this year, I don't know if every year they change colors for the notebook covers, but uh, I really like the color combination, the blues and the orange right here. So they also include a guide as you can see here. Oh, and stickers. Oh, this is so cute I forgot about their stickers stickers to customize and they have one two three four five stickers right there oh, and I love these too I love anything that has like a stamp um, motif motif and then it has a little information about this concept of traveling Traveler stamp has been quiet for the past few years, but it seems that recently the travelers are back in our town. Yes, and that's the reason why I got this. And I love the whole concept because we are all starting to travel again and and visit maybe the places that we didn't get to a few years ago. And uh, recently we traveled to South Korea and I was so happy to, to, to go there. Uh, we had such a great time so cannot wait to actually use my <clears throat> my planners to to capture that journey that we had there but yes um so we have these stickers what else do we have so this is the monthly layout 2024 over here you can customize it right there I don't really know how I'm gonna customize it yet. This is like a blank canvas for me, which is very exciting. Uh, so we have uh, 2024 and 2025 here. Oh, they have trackers right, right there. And I like that they have like uh, the week right there. really nice and then this is your monthly it starts with December and I'm guessing this is um, Japanese holidays so all of this is just uh, your monthly pages right there and something that I um, what I like, I guess, is that uh, you have like little books that you can kind of pile and and um, group on your um, TN uh, covers. So that's something different, something that I haven't done, and really looking forward to to play with my notebooks um, and match. I mean, set it up with my covers really exciting and we also have up to January 2025 Ooh, we has a map maybe I should highlight the places that I visited so far really nice oh and with the different time zones nice oh conversion chart nice and temperature as well 
Ooh, travel plan. This is so cute. And this, this is like a ruler, I guess. Oh, and you have also some blank pages over here, about five, I think. Oh, and also like the, the patchwork car. Whole, I like the whole traveling um, concept. Pretty nice. Right there. So this is what we have for um, the monthly diary for 2024. And then um, let's check the weekly. So here we have the weekly passport size diary. And did I get just I guess I only got, do they have two? Let's see. Okay, so I just checked and they only have one layout for their passport size weekly, which is the horizontal layout, which makes sense, I guess. Um, Cause it's such a tiny notebook and they divided it into two. So I guess half year here. Yeah, half year here and half year here. So this <clears throat> light blue teal uh, color notebook is for the first yeah first uh, half of the year from january to june right there and then we have also the monthly sorry the yearly um pages right there in a tracker as well really nice i don't really have a tiny <laughs> handwriting but um i guess i will have to to try to write tiny and then here we have december starts from the 18th of december and then it goes straight to uh, january and we have all of these pages right there And then ends on June 30th with, I guess, a little spread over here in your departure card, right there. And then similarly, we have over here um, from July to December, it's basically the same layout right there. And it goes all the way up to uh, January 5th. And you have a couple of spreads right there. Very nice. Oh, we also have stickers. It's always a surprise to get surprises. <laughs> so cute. So it's the same sticker set, I guess, as this one. Yeah, really nice. And also they include a guide right there. And now we have, let's check this, uh, the pencil board. And this is the first time I get a pencil board from um, Traveler's Notebook. And I must say, it is, I like the quality. It's definitely thicker than the Hobonichi one. Very sturdy. And I love the gold. Is this gold or rose gold? Uh, that they have here. This is so cute really nice and this is their folder right there maybe to hold your stickers right here or maybe you know you're traveling and maybe you have tickets and then you just want to gather them there really nice and now let's check the regular size. 
I guess we'll start with their pencil board. I really like the illustrations here, right there. Really nice. Oh yes, and I like that they have this grid right there to help you write if the paper is just a blank uh, page. Right there. I remember now. Yeah, so last year I was like, you know, let me get, I just wanted to get the stickers, I remember. <clears throat> because at the time I didn't really think that I, I would use a TN for uh, planning or journaling. Actually, no. Journaling, yes. Uh, and also, you know, like uh, having an art journal, but not for planning. So, but I did like their stickers. So let me just show you. This is so adorable. Oh, I love this. I hope I got two sets. <laughs> I don't know why I thought that uh, you will get you will get this with the weeklies, but I guess all this long <laughs> you were able to buy them separately. But anyways, so you get um, like I think these are tabs. Yes, so you can use these tabs to mark each month. It may be um, different sections like a travel section, memo list, important or information. Oh, this is also for the um, passport size. This is a small size. Oh, really nice. I like that. Isn't this adorable? So these are little icons that you can use. Really nice. Oh, I really like these too. I love the colors. They're like dot uh, stickers right there. Wow, I like these too. Oh. Are these stickers or? Yeah, I think so. Really nice. I love the detail in the gold. So cute. I love that bus. And then they also have these letters right there. I cannot wait to customize my traveler's notebook for 2024. And then more information about what you're getting. Oh, it has a preview over here. Oh, and how to use them as well. Nice. Okay, so it's an index, index sticker, schedule sticker, clear round sticker, and film packet sticker. Oh, so these are packets. And these are uh, dry transfer. Oh, those are transfer sheets. Okay. And these are just customized sticker. I guess with a theme or traveling. Right there. Oh, so nice. This is just too cute. Okay. So, uh, and now we have the folder right there. I also like this color. It's kind of like an orange peachy color. It reminds, uh, it reminds me to our trip to Jeju. The tangerines. There were tangerines everywhere. Everywhere. And everybody was dressed with tangerine hats, tangerine pins, tangerine everything. Um, so cute. And okay, so now I think we have the section of the weekly diaries or memos. I don't know what's the difference. Yeah, diary. Okay, so they call this one weekly and, and memo. And this is just a weekly vertical diary. Okay, so let's start with the guide. I oh, love the illustrations. Oh, and they have two stickers. So cute. And I love that they are like kind of like a paper texture type of thing. And now let's see the actual notebooks. And they also have them section in two from January to June 
and I'm guessing it's a similar uh, setup as the passport. Oh, you have a little space over there for all the travelers who have a, sp a free spirit. I guess you can buy here if you goals for the year. So nice. Now I guess a tracker. Oh, I wonder what would I, I track on my maybe traveling tracker. But I don't I won't travel every day, so hmm. Maybe places I would like to visit <laughs> or that I'm thinking of that day so it starts on December 18 I really like the color of the paper it's a little different from their other notebooks I think yeah and even from this one the paper here it's a little bit more yellow in comparison to this I think so yeah a little bit more and this is definitely warmer. The other one is a little bit reddish. And it has like a um, grid over here with lines similar to the lines here. Oh, and it has like a little um, subdivisions right here in the middle as a guide. Oh, and you have over here the month. <coughs> The previous month and the next month. Oh, and the week as well. Let's continue. I may start this in December just to test it out. Mm -hmm. Okay, so <clears throat> here starts January. June 30th. And then a blank spread, and your departure card. Right, right there. Lovely. And then similar setup, July to December. Trucker. Yeah, starts on July up to February twenty-eighth. <laughs> I just want to check so it ends on January 5th I guess because uh, of December like the full week the last week of the year ends on January 5th and then you have two spreads right there with blank pages and your departure card So this was the weekly and memo diary and now the weekly vertical I'm so excited about this this is my favorite layout across the board um, I'm looking for planners that just have this layout that they don't have anything extra just the vertical weekly layout and so far, I don't think I have found any because I, I just want the vertical and I want them to be slim. But I guess this is it. <laughs> so let me check uh, what we have here. So we have the same uh, sticker as the weekly and memo. It's always nice to have duplicates and we also have the guide nice oh I like these two is it the same as the little one Let me see. no it's not the same the illustrations are all over the page I think we have this person here with these travelers right there cute Okay, so that's the guide, and then, oh, I love this color combination as well. Fall is my favorite um, season of the year, 
so i really like this this color combination okay so we have from january to june the trackers nice okay i just remembered i actually have the undated version and i'm loving it um yes and this this is definitely different because over here you have the months as far as i remember it doesn't have obviously it doesn't have the months here because it's uh, undated um but I, i'm trying to remember what it has here instead maybe a, a space um, but yes, over here you have the um, previous month and then the upcoming months. I don't think we really need all of this, personally, I think. Hmm. And then you have over here a note section, which I think they also have that on the undated version. Ooh, they have over here like I don't know if you can see here <laughs> I'm looking at every detail um, and most of you may have already seen this but this is the first time that I actually get to hold one of these um, so here we have a like the, the noon uh, time over here it's in red and I wonder why maybe it's lunch break <laughs> lunch break is very important Sometimes I forget to take my lunches. Right there. And Sunday is also in red. I wonder if, yes, all Sundays are in red. Oh, yes. And this is a Monday start. I guess it's a default. You don't get to pick if it's a Sunday or a Monday. So that's really nice. Okay, so December starts on December 18. Then we have January all the way to June 30th, right there. I don't remember how this paper behaves with inks because I really want to also um, next year try to use more of my um, inks and my ink pens, my fountain pens. But yes, so this is that, and then this is the other half, July to December. Same setup. <clears throat> we have both months over here marked. Oh yes, because we have October and November in that same week. I really like this because sometimes you know I need to reference what the MRI one month it is <laughs> um, but I definitely don't think we need all or maybe we do we'll see and then we have January 5th and two spreads right there and your departure card lovely sadly i think i made a mistake and i didn't place an order for the monthly uh, diary on the regular size so thankfully they have it available still so <laughs> i'm gonna go get it before it gets sold out because i really want to have all their like the whole set so that i can experience and try uh, the whole, I guess, uh, lineup on both sizes because um, you definitely get different experiences on on different sizes of your sketchbooks or notebooks or planners. And I like to to test things out and and live in them. <laughs> um, and experience you know that time with my sketchbooks or in this case planners so I'm really looking forward to set all this up and and also I have to pick what um, covers I'm gonna be using for each of them um, 
they are covers um i have a few of the covers so um that's gonna be another video though um but for now so happy that i got to um get my hands on their 2024 lineup and i cannot wait to to set them up and to actually start um planning or um, memory keeping on them that's another thing i think it's gonna be mostly memory keeping maybe and i also want to use the stickers and be a little bit more creative with them currently my planner um my everything planner is my actually my life planner is my uh hobonichi weeks um it's been my life planner for the last three years or so and i really like the setup i'm so used to it it's like my comfort zone every time that i need to make lists or i have to do's or um, track appointments and everything so i don't think i'm gonna change that uh, however i do want to try um, these traveler notebook uh, planners to um, have a little bit more how can i say this um fun i guess and 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 try new things and use um stationery that i haven't been able to to maybe use because I, uh, my planner actually most of my planners are just very how can i say this <laughs> they are very um I, um not just repetitive because they are just they're very plain in a way they are very focused on the tasks that i need to do so and and that's their purpose you know and they and they have met, met their purpose and they have helped me throughout these years and everything that i need to keep track on but i think i need to uh in terms of having this type of setup um i want to try something new so really looking forward to to try my traveler's notebook diaries for next year uh, let me know if you have tried um, these planners before or if you're new like me and if you got to get any of these um, TNs or if you're thinking maybe of getting them for next year but yes this is all for now thank you so much if you join me until the end of this video take care Bye-bye.